Hello kittens! Silver here, and today I'm going to be doing a review of the Sun Lemon Pomeranian plush. So this guy was a birthday gift from a few years back. I'm thinking we're going on three years now, which is just unbelievable to me. But he came straight from Japan. That is where Sun Lemon plushies are produced, so more than likely you'll have to order overseas if you are interested in them. Uh, US retailers really don't carry them very often. Sometimes you do see them on eBay, but Japan is usually your best bet to find these guys. And um, he is just an absolute puffball of pure delight and joy. He is absolutely adorable. He measures about 14 inches long, and he resembles a cloud in more ways than one. Not just in look, but in feel. He is absolutely just tremendously soft. Super, super lovely long coat. He's got that nice little um, curled tail here at the end and the signature sort of embroidered paw pads, which are always indicative of Sun Lemon plushies. And there's this little hang tag here. They have very, very large hang tags. So um, it's, it's definitely difficult to resist the urge to, to cut them just because they are, you know, very, uh, very obtrusive. But, you know, being a collector, it's, it's very difficult for me to, <laughs> to, you know, sort of take the scissors out and, and go to that length. But Anyway, so he's an all-over white dog except for his muzzle here, which is a, a nice light cream color. And he's got a little black hand-threaded mouth with some black airbrush markings. And he has a black plastic nose and dark round eyes that are sort of rimmed with a... Um, they're sort of rimmed in dark brown. He's got the... they sort of look all black from, you know, from this vantage point. But um, yeah, it's a very, very dark brown. I'm just looking closer. Um, now one thing about him that was a little bit different than the cats that I usually collect from this company is that he's not quite as floppy. He is very bean filled. Um, you could probably hear he's got a nice big bean pouch in there, but he does also have some added stuffing to give him a little bit more form. Um, so, I mean, he is floppy though. He is definitely still floppy, just not as highly posable as the cats tend to be. He pretty much is, you know, just sort of in this position. You can't really... Um, bend his midsection too much. He's just kind of in this sort of sprawled out pose, but he's an absolute, an absolutely adorable um, representation of a Pomeranian. I think he's one of the cutest Pomeranians ever produced. I know I, I always sing the praises of, uh, of Douglas Cuddle Toys, but I do actually um, have a very, very big affinity for other plush brands as well. Sun Lemon definitely being one of them. He is the only dog from Sun Lemon that I currently own, but who knows, that may change sometime in the future. So that is my little Sun Lemon Pomeranian. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing him, and I'll be back again soon with some more plush goodness. Bye, everybody!